It is an amazing tale of survival. Dog walker Annette Poitras spent more than two days lost in the backcountry of Eagle Mountain in Coquitlam. Today we are hearing from her husband as to how she managed to survive in the cold and the rain. Jordan Armstrong has our top story. Husband Marcel Poitras arrives at the hospital with fresh clothing for his wife, who remains in Royal Columbian for at least another day. She's doing really good. Um, no broken bones. She's a lot of real muscle pain. She's not really able to walk yet, although hopefully they've got her up walking. Today, new details on Annette's incredible tale of survival. On Monday, the night she slipped and hurt herself in the Coquitlam watershed, she spotted one of the search helicopters and tried desperately to get its attention by waving her jacket. She crawled to a, a place where she could, you know, there was no branches right above her. Her knees are all bruised from crawling through the, the dirt. Um, so she knew they were out there, um, but she had lost her cell phone when she fell, probably about 5 o'clock Monday night. Marcel says one of the dogs stood guard, another searched for food, while the third cuddled his wife, keeping her warm. The animals also taught her a survival trick. She happened to notice one of the dogs was digging a hole to sleep in, and then she kind of like, you know, the, the undergrowth and everything. It's very um, spongy. It soaks up a lot of water. So she started sweeping away all the, the brush and everything to get down to the dirt and kind of made herself a little well to sleep in. And when Roxy the boxer got too cold? So she took off one of her rain jackets to put over the boxer. Nearly 100 volunteers from across B.C. searched for three days in brutal weather. Annette was found late Wednesday morning following a tip from another hiker and a single ping from her lost cell phone. Marcel forever grateful to all the volunteers. These, these people are doing this on their own time. They're, they're leaving their job, they're, they're what they get paid to do to pay their mortgage, to come out and help people who need the help. So thank you. Thank you very much. Jordan Armstrong, Global News.